Well, here we are again. Today we're gonna look over, I don't know if we can get all the way through the video. We may have to split it up into sections or something like that, I don't know. Or we might just get into it and not be interested in it after we get through it for a little bit. I don't know, we'll have to see. It's uh, Adam, uh, it's, it, I guess this guy, Triple T, um, it's, the title of it is Adam Calhoun comes up on the panel to confront Triple T. So we're getting it. We're going to look at that, see what's going on with that. Um, I can get more hate mail in my comments uh, from the clowns that love to give me stupid comments all of a sudden. So anyway, let's get right into this, uh, this video. And we got Mr. Adam Calhoun. Yeah, I wish you would have kept that one dude with the blue shirt or whatever on. This Could one be? No. I think he's talking about Brandon. Him? Yeah. Okay. What's up, Adam? Yeah, you got a lot to say. What? You got a lot to say. I mean, I got a lot of facts. You, you do? I mean, honestly, speaking from it, from... From following both of y'all, from following all of it, for real. I mean, you have to look at it and from my perspective. I'm nobody. I'm just a dude that goes. Here we go. Here we go. Somebody with a bunch of facts. I don't know where, what, what we'll see. Uh, I mean, what, what facts about what? Because the work every day that respects real because that's how I grew up. If you got a friend, you stick with that dude. For yeah, real. when did I turn my back on Ryan? You did, dog. Come when? on. When? Okay, all right. For, honestly, Adam, for real. When when you said you was done with rapping and all this stuff, up church, come out to you and made an album with you. That shit was big. You know it was. What? That shit I said was I big. was done rapping and then made an uh, album. No, with you, you 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 was you was almost done with. You said that. You said that. No, no, for no, real. no, 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 no. Yeah, you, you did. For real, you. Are said you talking that. about hooligan? Yeah, hooligan. I never said I was done rapping and then made an album with. Yeah, you when you when you done that hooligan, that's what you said. That's what inspired you to do it. That's what you said that it it, it made you want to do it some more. Did you not say that? I've always said. I've always gave Ryan his props, whatever. No, for real, Adam. Shit. Did you not say that? Man, I don't remember. Hold on. Come so on, dog. I've been following, dude. I've been following both of y'all. I used to like you. I don't Adam, give a fuck if you like me or not, dog. I, I know you don't because I'm nobody. I get that. But what I'm saying nobody. is, Up Church has always had your back. No. Always. I've always had his you, back. You, he had your back. <laughs> so you, why, okay. Why, so you why are, why are you commenting on why are you commenting on shit when when Mises is on this shit now? Why are you not scared to comment? Do you think Talk someone's about, scared? Oh, I gotta get some shit off my shoulders. Do you do you think someone's scared of Ryan? You should be scared of what, dude? Come scared on, scared of what? This is what confuses me, and I and and I'm I have I've, I've been having these people come on my. YouTube channel now and just talk about how I'm a Ryan up church hater and all this kind of shit. Watch the videos. I, I mean, I'm just, I'm just telling you through these videos, what I see. And if it sheds a bad light on someone, don't get mad at me, get mad at them. And it's clowns like this guy right here, man. The things he knows, all the ins and outs of what's going on, it, it just really blows my mind. I, I, I'm literally watching the video and giving my perspective of it. So whatever. And this guy, I mean, he sitting here claims he knows that that you know if it wasn't for Up Church and this the Hooligan album, this then it wouldn't have made you know. It, Adam would have been gone or whatever. But my thing about it is, um, he did say, I remember Adam when he, he's the, the, when he put out rap shit, he was talking about that, that he was going to 
change and uh, go away from making albums. But he did say that he never said he was going to completely quit rapping. He was talking about how he was going to still do, you know, his own, like, like he did with Tom, like he did with, with, with church, with, you know, do, do stuff like that. But as far as him putting a whole lot of effort in doing his own album at the time, he wasn't going to do that anymore. So he never said he wasn't going to do those things. And I'm not trying to start anything. I'm just saying. Scared of what? Scared of what? You Let's just go. This is where I lost my thought there for a second. Who the hell? Why are people so hell bent on thinking that people are scared of Ryan Upchurch? Or scared of Adam Calhoun? Or scared of this person? Or scared of that person? Nobody's scared of anybody. I don't understand this. What, what, where you people live in a different realm or something because grown men aren't scared of other grown men. What, what you people are nuts. You obviously are. You be sneak dissing all the time, dog. Sneak it. Scared. Come of on. What? Bro, we're all going to die someday. What am I scared? You know, you're right. 2020, to... dude, this world sucks. You're right. But no, you over here on. rapping dude, with Tom McDonald. He don't give it. Dude, Tom McDonald is making that music because he he's, making he's making money. Hey, he's making money. He's making money. Hey, right, hey pause. Pause. Come on, because, for real. Because this, like, like yelling isn't going to be constructed you're, by you're me. You're talking Sorry. about people I, I, are scared? You, you want to you know why I haven't said anything? Why? Because you're going to ruin him? No, he's going to ruin you, for real. You so you want to hear his piece, though, Brandon? My sentences. Can you get this dude out of here? All right. Go ahead, Adam. For how many months? Two months, I haven't said shit. Because I'm like, all right, I'm having a kid. I'm trying to change the person I am. I'm trying to not react with anger. So I'm like, I'm going to take, fuck this. I'm going to take the high road. I don't need to deal with this shit. It's the internet. Fuck the internet. Everybody's on the internet talking shit on the internet. Uh, so I don't, so finally I start being more um, reflective and I start, I start looking at, at things differently. And all that did was make all these little motherfucking pieces of shit come out of the woodwork and think that they can attack me because I'm being quiet. So because I'm being quiet, <laughs> they think whatever Ryan says is the truth. Triple T, you said on one of your lives, I'm not saying, I just heard, you know, he got into a fight with the officers and I'm not saying, but allegedly one of them was a woman. Get the fuck out of here, bro. My fucking records are all public. This is okay. the type of shit that I'm talking about. You just got motherfuckers on the internet talking wild, just crazy ass shit. And 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 what I'm and I'm supposed to be like, all right, well, fuck it, let them let them say whatever they want. Yeah, I guess right. Because now if I jump in this live, it's like, well, why is he jumping in this live? It's it's like enough is enough. First of all, Mises shouldn't be... I can't tell Chuck what to fucking do. Anyone that knows that motherfucker, and I've known that dude for fucking 30 years. You're Anyone. the puppet master, bro. Huh? I said you're the puppet master. Every, I'm sorry, I'm, sorry, I'm not helping this. Anyone that knows that dude in real life knows that they can't tell him shit. He's going to do whatever the fuck he's going to do <coughs> regardless of what you tell him. He moves by what God says to him. Yeah, hundred percent. That's what I said earlier. Now your mother died. Yeah. This motherfucker who was just on here, oh, up church, up church, I'll suck your dick up church. That motherfucker that was just on here, saying, "Oh, how come Adam's coming in your lives now and fucking saying comments?" How many times have I been in your live and said something? Two other times. Okay. When your mother, when you post that picture of your mother, did I go, did I comment on that? Uh, 
So, so, so what I'm gathering here is um, Adam right at this point is pissed off at this triple T guy um, because he said something about uh, that. I guess he was uh, allegedly had uh, hit a woman cop when he got arrested. Adam is saying this is why would you put that out there if you don't have any hard evidence of this? You know, his record is public. You can look at it and tell. So, you know, what he's basically saying is truthfully too, why don't you put in the research, man? If if his record is public, you could have easily have just looked gone, you know, requested this information without instead of just saying, Hey man, allegedly he beat a woman up. You know, I can see his side on this. I don't know. I have to go back and look. Yeah, it's there. Regardless of what you were saying about me, because you know what? Life is more fucking important. Like I said, people are dying. I'm, I'm going to be worried about Ryan Upchurch. Hell yeah, he's going to end your career. End my fucking career. This all started by that dumbass video that I made a comment and I said, yo, air me the fuck out then. Quit fucking talking about it and air me the fuck out. Cause I know damn well you ain't ever gonna walk out on no motherfucking street and see me. You ain't gonna go pick a patch of fucking grass and see me there. You're gonna argue with me and fuck with me on the internet. That's why nobody says Ryan's name because they don't feel like going back and fucking forth on the internet with a grown ass fucking man. Why didn't you call him? Did that. Why don't you go to his house? Did that. Why don't you call his people? Did that. I did all that shit. And now me making the me fucking coming up here saying what I'm saying. Now I'm gonna have to deal with whatever's dumb ass shit is said on the fucking internet back. I have dude, I have my fucking name, my fucking word. No one fucking question when he said, Oh, he's he did these diss tracks. Now people are saying I did diss tracks about him when I was recording with Tom and I recorded these diss tracks at his fucking house. What the fuck are people talking about? No one said, well, where are these diss tracks? Where are these diss tracks? Where are these fucking diss tracks? I'm such a snake. Where are they? It's true. It's true. I mean, if you have, this is my thing. I From watching church over the years, I can tell you if he had something, he would have already just put put that out there. I'm telling you. So, who's lying here? Is it is Adam lying about it, or or is Church lying about it? According to Adam in his uh, latest video, he claims that Church already has diss tracks <clears throat> on people that <clears throat> are supposedly his friends right now. For a just in case scenario, he already has diss tracks already set out, ready to go on each person. Is this a? I don't know. Is that as in the rap community? Is this is a common thing to create diss tracks about everybody just in case? I don't know. I, I'm not a rapper, so I don't know. It's a good question. I can't answer that. Nobody fucking can. Neither can I. So I'm so my whole fucking reputation, my fucking I'm the I am the real motherfucker. Have I fucked up? Yes. Have I made mistakes? Yes. Have I said the wrong fucking things? Yes. Am I fucking human? Yes. Did I fuck Ryan up church over? Never. He's like, oh, he was the middleman when Jelly Roll and Struggle came to my house. No, motherfucker. I was your friend. These motherfuckers call me like, yo, you better call your boy and tell him we're coming. Okay, hold up. Call him. No answer. Dear dog. Hey, get over to Ryan's. Why? Because Jelly Roll and Struggle are coming over. Why? I don't know. They don't seem too happy, but they don't seem like they're on some bullshit. They don't seem happy about it, though. I'm hopping on a plane going down there right fucking now. Why? Because I don't want to see no bullshit happen between my friends who I thought were fucking friends. Because when I... See, I can see that. I can see that. You know, I can see that when, when me and my friends. If... If what well, if my friends are having a beef with each other, I'm you know and I, I could do I would have done the same thing. Like, hey man, what the hell's going on? Why y'all why y'all doing this? 
I mean, they're friends. Um, but, you know, of course, because he actually tried to be a friend, he was, I guess, considered a middleman trying to start shit. Doesn't make any sense. I met fucking struggle for the first time. I met him at Upchurch's house, and all Upchurch had to say about him was good fucking things. There's a picture of all four of us, me, Jelly, Struggle, and Upchurch together. That to me is a legendary picture. I thought it was us versus fucking the world. And hey, it's outside can- of the studio when I did country rap tunes and put Colt Ford on the album was fucking. I was. I was. I shouldn't say put him on the album. I was fucking honored to have Colt Ford, the Lax, all these old school fucking guys who are originators in this fucking lane. That's what I did. Broadnax is on the album. Upchurch is on the album. Demon's on the fucking album. Struggle's on the fucking album. Jelly's on the fucking album. That's a fucking shout out and paying homage to all the fucking guys who came before me. Hey, hey, Adam, pause real quick. Um, Because the chat's asking, can you clarify, please, that you did not make a diss track against Ryan? Motherfucker, I, I... do you not speak English in the fucking chat? Do you not hear what the fuck I'm saying? There you go. And they're also asking, did you give them his address or not? Ryan knows that I didn't give his fucking address. I wouldn't give a motherfucker Ryan's phone number. Ryan knows that I didn't give him his their fucking address, his address. I'm sorry, that wasn't for me. I was just like pointing that because I, I apparently people can't like hear between the lines. So hold up, so hold up. I could have made a video out of this. And fucking did my own little video and clipped it all together and made a video about all this shit. But I came on your channel because I'm sick of hearing all this fucking bullshit. And, and half, of, half of it is just speculation. Nobody knows what the fuck they're talking about. Do I give a fuck if Ryan Upshurst doesn't like me? You know what? It sucks because there's a lot of good things that I remember with Ryan. If, if, we're not, if we're not friends anymore, okay. That shit happens. Is Ryan going to end my fucking career? End my career, motherfucker. Let's get it on. Ain't no one scared of Ryan Upchurch in fucking person, on a microphone, anywhere. The only fucking thing that nobody wants to do, and I'm talking about all of his fucking peers, is go on the fucking internet like some bitches and go back and forth talking shit about each other. Why is everyone so fucking quiet? Makes sense to me. I mean, the guy, the, these guys are busy, and you, you know, he, he's right about Upchurch, though. I mean, he's going to throw jabs the whole time, or back and forth on the internet. He'll take it as long as you want to go. And to, I mean, I can understand if he's trying to avoid this type of thing in his life i can see him saying screw this i'm not dealing with this right now i'm 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 with you why are you so quiet Triple T? what are you uh, quiet about what what come on what you got to say dog i've been up here dag on advocating for mises and this all this bullshit yeah you know what's funny though you never advocate for fucking me for what what did i do to what did i do Okay, so whatever fight church music. says is Hold fucking on. gold, no, right? No, no, no. That's where you're wrong, right there, because I'm not a church lackey. And anybody who knows me knows I'm not a church lackey. I, I there's a lot. There's a lot of things church says that I don't hold agree up, with. Hold up, hold up. So church says, church says, hey man, out of respect for your family, I got a lot of dirt on you, motherfucker. You don't think everyone's got a lot of dirt on you? <laughs> Okay, but what that's between you and church. What's that got to do with me? I'm saying church says I got a lot of dirt on you, but for respect to your family, I ain't going to say it. Church don't think a lot of people got a lot of fucking dirt on him. I'm sure they do. Okay. Do you think I, that's why I said air me the fuck out then. Let's get it on, motherfucker. Let's go. D- did someone take that as a fucking sign of me being scared? Motherfucker, I never, my whole life I is never on said, this bitch. First of all, Adam, I never said you were scared. And then he says, and then he says, out of respect for your family, I'm not going to do that because I'm such a good guy. Motherfucker, you ain't got respect for my family. You ain't got respect for your own motherfucking family. And guess what? There's a fucking dead fucking little teenage girl 
that this motherfucker's talking about all the fucking time that has fucking parents that are grieving? Does he give a fuck about their family? And I disagree with you on that as well. Bullshit, sucking dick shit. Ain't nobody scared of fucking Ryan up, church. The fuck out of here. Adam's going crazy right now. He's pissed off. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. His sucker's really angry right now. Uh, really, really angry. And obviously, the tension right now, this between the him and this this triple T guy, is uh, looks like he's supposed to get into it because there you could tell there's some type of animosity here. Regardless of what these this triple T guy is saying, you could see it in him. I don't I don't even know this guy, but you could see he's hesitant to speak too much. Here, the only thing that anyone's fucking annoyed about is Ryan Upchurch going online, making seven hundred million motherfucking videos, and fucking airing everybody's business out. Well, guess what, motherfucker? You got dirt on you too, bitch. I know that for a fact. So fucking let's get it. Air me the fuck out. Don't act like, oh, no, I didn't even see that video. Oh, no, I didn't hear that song. Oh, no, I don't know who this person is. Man, shut the fuck up. So to the chat again real quick. I, 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 fuck I think that like... chat. Fuck that chat, whoever's asking these dumbass fucking questions. Fuck you. Motherfucker, well, I'm, I'm... I've been doing this and been the same motherfucker for eight motherfucking years. I haven't changed up my fucking stance on shit. What, I went and worked with Tom McDonald? Last time I saw him and Tom McDonald, he's showing his mom Tom McDonald. He's fucking talking about Tom McDonald all the motherfucking time. Yeah, and no. All of a sudden he hates Tom McDonald. Then he hates Struggle. Then he hates fucking Jelly. Then he hates fucking this motherfucker. Then he's mad at this motherfucker. Doesn't he need to take a fucking look in the mirror and say, oh, maybe I'm the motherfucker. I'm, t- I'm, t- I'm talking about you guys, and and you do have fans in the chat too. Man, like they're fuck sticking that up. Chat. I don't give a fuck about that chat. I'm I know, looking at you, Triple T, right in your fucking face. Why in the fuck would you go Hold online? On. Hold on, motherfucker. You ain't gonna come up here and that don't disrespect let's me. Let's go. I'll go to your fucking. Let's do let's this. Let's go. Come to my your fucking house, house then. I, will I wish go to your you house, would, motherfucker. Because I will ass. bust your motherfucking ass with a gun. That's recently. about it. No, <laughs> this this is getting kind of ridiculous. I mean, damn. I mean. <coughs> what the hell's going on right here? They're talking about whooping this man's ass. This is getting out of control. A gun, a gun, no. That's about it. Right here. Right here, motherfucker. Let you me tell tomorrow? you something. I'll be there. Let me tell you something, Adam. I'll be there tomorrow. Yes. I'll be there tomorrow. Just because you've been, you been to prison, it. don't intimidate nobody, my brother. I'll be there tomorrow. Let me t- Hold up. What? 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 So... This is what this is the kind of shit that, that it makes makes me think this guy has some animosity toward uh, Adam here. Because when did Adam bring up prison? This guy just throws it out there. Because you've been to prison. Who gives a shit? I don't understand. <laughs> <coughs> it, it's crazy to me. I don't. Two grown men talking about throwing fighting and shit, you know, whatever. It's kind of strange. Do it. Let's do it. I'll, I'll be, be there tomorrow. I'll be there tomorrow. I'll be there tomorrow. I'll be there tomorrow. Come on, then. I'll be there tomorrow. You want to say that I beat women? I'll be there tomorrow, motherfucker. Well, look, motherfucker, I'll put my address in the fucking private chat, so, and you so, pull up to this motherfucker. Hold How about you that? Guaranteed. It's guaranteed. Pause, pause, guys, up. guys, 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 guys. Everybody here, knows that, though. Fuck. Everybody already knows that. Fucking, fucking pull up there. So I, I will say, because me and Tim got told that at the same time, and, and uh, Tim has called that out to have been misinformation before. He he did admit that that was that was. Mis- There's my fucking address conveyed. in the private chat. Pull the I, fuck I'm up. I'm happy to come over because you ain't going to do shit. Scared. You think I'm scared of you because you get on the Internet? I've been to prison. I've been to prison. Look here, well, motherfucker. Fuck this ain't prison. prison politics. This ain't prison politics. I don't Just because you've been to politics. prison don't mean shit. I've been to motherfucking combat. I'm battle testing combat approved. What the fuck you want to do for a dollar two? Your service, but that ain't got nothing hey, to do with your Fuck you in my fucking service. How about that? Yeah, yeah, cool, cool. It's easy to do that shit on the internet. Yeah, it is easy to do it on the internet. Just like it's easy to you to come up here and be a fucking dick. I don't just do this shit on the internet. Well, then pull up then. I will. Good. You better pack a lunch. Motherfucker, so, I ain't got to pack shit. You better pack a fucking lunch. 
Just don't sue me. How about that? Oh, I ain't gonna shoot you. No, don't sue Trust me. me. I don't give a fuck. I, I ain't gonna sue you either. I'll sign whatever the fuck you want. You ain't gotta sign shit. shit. And we do the shit right in the fucking in the street or in the bro, fucking you backyard. Like, I, don't no I don't give a fuck. You ain't got to talk about it no more. You already sent it. Hey, let's go. Let's get it, baby. Shit. Let's go. There's two things I like to do in this world, and that's fight and fuck. And I'd rather fight than fuck. Oh, yeah, well, that's what everybody says. Oh, I'm about it. Okay. What are we going to see? Well, we are going to see. This is what I, this is very, very funny to me. Um, this is, this has always been a, a, a point of funniness to me. Um, I've been training uh, jujitsu, Brazilian jujitsu, for 24 years. Black, I'm a black belt, and it, you know, it's amazing to me these people that don't train, literally train every day. I mean, uh, all of a sudden have these t awesome fighting skills. All of a sudden, I mean, uh, it's just hilarious to me. I, it, it's funny to me. It. it this is this is this is just a stupid thing to be doing. I mean, if anything, this 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 fighting bullshit could have been handled not on the internet. I mean, this just looks dumb. This is this truthfully is very sad right here. Okay, cool. What else? Cool. Cool. What else you got? What else? What else you got? You want to come up here and no, you want to sit up shit? there. You want to sit up there and say that I fucking hit touch a female officer. Look here. Did you not say I, that? I said that you were arrested, and allegedly, the rumor had it that what you rumor? hit. The rumor that's been running around for the last fucking five years on the fucking internet about your fucking arrest that you fucking accidentally fucking hit a female cop. So I've never heard that rumor in my fucking life anywhere on the internet as well. I will have to say, I have never heard this either. Be honest about it. I, I've never heard a rumor of Adam hitting a woman. I mean, I understand he's pissed off and I would be pissed off as well. But to talk about uh, meeting up and fighting about that shit is kind of, mm, I, I mean, I wouldn't. I'd say it's kind of we're, we're we're bordering on ghetto right here. Um, it's one thing to be, uh, you know, stand up for yourself, but to over some internet bullshit, uh, you want to fight, go travel to somebody's house and fight. I don't know. I, I just think that's a little overboard. So I I uh, remember when it, it's out there. I remember okay. when it came because it came to. It, it it came to us. We actually talked about it a little while after, and uh, Tim did acknowledge that it wasn't true, though, at one point, I believe. I might be wrong. Oh, no, he hasn't. No, he never has. Yes. <laughs> okay. I mean, did, did I, 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 like, I, I think you did, though, didn't you? I did. My That's records okay. are all fucking public. That's fine. Right, right. right. So maybe no, you why don't about you do your some record. research before you fucking before you fucking say some dumbass shit like that, bro. Th there's three things in this world. There's three things in this fucking world that you could that are the worst things possible: touching a little fucking kid, no rape, shit. and hitting a woman. So for you to fucking have some type of issue with me on the internet and say that fucking ooh, alleged and but you know what you're doing and basically saying that I fucking hit a woman that never happened okay and i said if it didn't i apologize but, if, but that was the rumor didn't. that was running around if, you think uh, i'm the only one that heard that no you're the only one that i heard talk about it though yeah cuz i got the balls to say it balls you have the balls to say something that's not true what what a ridiculous statement because you have the balls to say something that is not true. <laughs> That's a really dumb statement there. I think he should uh, retract that one uh, because that doesn't mean you have balls, my friend. That means you you didn't do your research and you said something incorrectly. Oh, fuck. That's crazy. Seems like there's a whole bunch of guys on the internet that got a lot of fucking balls to say a bunch of shit that's not true. Yep. 
but you're not going to intimidate me like you did. Bro, Captain I'm Kirk. not trying to intimidate you. Yeah, you, you know are. that I don't give a fuck about coming to your yeah, house. I don't, I don't care. I don't give a fuck either. Okay, no, I said, no, fuck either. stop talking about it. I don't give a no, fuck. I'm not talking about it. You're the you one still said, talking about it. You just said. You're the one still I'm talking not about intimidate it. intimidate you. I'm not trying to intimidate you're you. You're not going to intimidate me. The only reason. Good, man. Good. The Good. only reason I brought that up is because what you said about me personally, I don't I have to protect my fucking name as a man? Yeah, you should. Okay. And as a man, you think you should be fucking talking shit about another man about fucking hitting a fucking woman? When you can literally just go and get the fucking paperwork right there. It's fucking open to the public. Facts. That's you fact. will never find a fucking arrest record on Adam Calhoun for touching a fucking female ever, period. And when I come to your house and we do whatever the fuck we do, and when it's all we over do. and we're sitting there, I guarantee you, you're you going to understand what type of motherfucker I am before I leave and there. You're going to understand, understand who I am. You damn right you are. are. And you're going to be you fucking right. happy as fuck to know who I am. And I'm sure I'll be happy to know you as well. Oh, I will. This ain't. This is not a fucking game to me. This is my fucking life. This is not a game to me either. This is not a game to me either. This is not a game to me either. Yeah, well, you're playing with people's lives like it's a game. How am I playing with your fucking life like it's... Man, how long is this shit going to go on where these, these two dudes talk about fighting each other, man? Oh, I mean, are we going to get into anything with substance here? Or, I mean, this is ridiculous. Uh, I don't know, man. It, it, this is a bad look for both of them. This Triple T fella and Adam. This is a bad look, man. This really is a bad look. It, 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 this is ridiculous. It's a game. Because you're fucking putting my name out there and all this dumbass fucking conspiracy. I haven't said your fucking name since you fucking did fight music. Okay. I don't care if you listen. That's another thing Ryan said. Oh, there's tons of people that don't like my music. If a reactor doesn't like you, I don't give a flying fuck if a reactor doesn't like my fucking music. I like Here's your fuck I, around and find out song with Brian. Uh, with Brian. Uh, Brian Martin. Yeah, him. I thought Thank the shit you. was dope. Thank you. I don't care. Thank you. I don't care if a fucking reactor doesn't like my music. I, I don't care. It's it's everyone's. Some people, this person's their favorite artist. Some people, this person's their favorite artist. I don't care who likes my fucking music. I don't care what reactor likes my music or what reactor doesn't like my music. What I do care is when a reactor's like, oh, he's taking shots at John. Oh, he's taking shots at Ryan. Oh, he's taking shots. What? If I was going to take a shot at Ryan, I would just say, fuck you, motherfucker. That's it. But no, you guys want to see me and Ryan go. Ryan wants to see me and Ryan go. Why would I want to see? First of all, that is a false statement right there. No, it isn't. Yes, no, it, it isn't. You more can't say that we want to see more you two go. For you guys. Why? 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 Why does? What would it do that? It's going to divide the fucking fan base. Half a goon squad is Creek squad. Half a Creek squad is goon squad. Why would we want the fans to fucking choose sides? Just like Jesus in church. Why do we want the fans to choose sides? That's what the fuck we've been up here for. They're trying to settle this fucking stupid shit. So, I don't want snake, the fans. Man. I don't want the fans to choose sides. But like, when I'm quiet for two fucking months, two months, I'm quiet. Right? Okay. And still, still, this shit's still going on. And this motherfucker Ryan's still poking little jabs out there. See, that is true. What he's saying there is true. And regardless of how many people come on my my channel and comment stupid shit, that's a fact. When all this shit went down, Adam had nothing, just tried to let it go, tried to let the, the, the dust settle. But Upchurch didn't. Uch, Upchurch kept on Instagram, especially. Go to his Instagram page and watch his videos. Jab after jab after jab after jab until finally, finally, he responds. And when he responds, all of a sudden, Church puts out a video talking about he's a flea. 
to go get a life. He's constantly bringing his name up. When I'm confused. Poking little jabs out there. Motherfucker. There are certain people in this community wants that shit to happen. We're trying to stop the shit from happening. Okay. Hey, that's you know why what? we did. That's why two streams ago, we were on live for nine hours. They're trying to debunk all this bullshit about Mises and church that country rap Kendrick was a district district when it wasn't. Let, let, me, then, let me then the next night I went and fucking went live and I played nothing but church and music music back to back, back to back to show people how they should work I saw, together. I saw what you did. So you. how the fuck are we that going promoting you and fucking Ryan go at each other? Because <laughs> You weren't you weren't fucking sitting there with uh what's his name fucking cat on fight music yes okay yes on fight music okay. because it seemed like there was a lot okay. of subliminals in that fucking track okay but other than that what so I have been quite again you just said you weren't doing that and you just said you did so that's what I I'm said saying. on fight music yes okay there you go because after what happened the next day, you went live for the first time to talk about a bunch of conspiracy again. That's another. I who gives a fuck? So one one thing you guys see one thing you're like, oh, that's so why do you give a fuck about five reactors who's got less than fifty thousand subs? What do you care Bro, about? We have to because say because you're this community is a small community, and when people, I give a fuck if any. Yes, a small community. So you think we got the? Uh, we you think that we're in, in churches here? You think he's listening to us? Yes. Yes, he is. How do I know? His latest video, he stated that. <laughs> so, yeah, he is watching your videos and reading your comments. Has Church ever been on my panel? Have I ever had an interview with Church? No. I don't fucking know. No. You don't think he goes and sees what he don't? He, he, you, you think he doesn't see your videos? I'm sure he does. He's Fuck commenting yeah. on my videos. Yeah. Okay. Okay. But he don't listen to me. I think. I think what you. <laughs> I think Ryan Upchurch uh, in real life and Ryan Upchurch that you guys think on the internet are two different things. Actually, I don't think I fucking know for a fact. And it, uh, it's it's kind of actually sad. That's another reason why you want another reason why I didn't say anything for fucking because. Let me show you who I represent. Motherfucker. That's awesome, dude. That's who that? I rock with. That's cool. I love Jesse Howard. New breed. I, I don't know him. Yeah, you do. If you know Jesse Howard, you know No, New I've breed. never met him in my life. I've met Jesse Howard. I've been around Jesse Howard. What the hell is going on? I mean... We're just changing everything up. I mean, it's like back. This is this is confusing. Stay on, stay on point, guys. Stay, stay on the. Stay, try to. You, you, this this video is an hour and thirty minutes long. If y'all have stayed on track, dog, y'all and and stuck with what you were talking about instead of this kind of bullshit and talking about fighting in yards and so forth and so on. You could have you could have saved us some time here. It's like these they're just scatterbrained. They're just all everywhere right now. What the hell are we talking about? This is who I represent. I mean, come on, dog. I mean, it's just you're you're interviewing, truthfully, you, he's he's a guest on your platform. Stay on task. You, you, what what the hell? Yeah. Right, isn't that what we're arguing about? I don't know this person. I don't know that person. Never met this person. I never met I never met Newbreed. I've met Jesse Howard several times. Okay, and I think he's a great human. I don't know. He Newbury. is. He's my brother. Yeah, I don't know Newbury. Thank you for the super super chat, Wixter. So I'm here. If you got any other questions, I'm here. And so you don't got to guess no more or throw fucking stupid bullshit out there on the wall, fucking for views. Other than fight music, what have I said stupid about you? <laughs> Come on. You got people, okay, maybe not just specifically you, but the people that you have on your panel with you, they don't Those know. are subscribers of the panel. They're not they're not content creators. They're not you YouTube. You content creators on here? Yes. This guy right here. Everybody else was subscribers. No, 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 I'm not talking about today. I'm talking about in general. 
Yeah, sometimes they'll come up here. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So you have different content creators on there who are who are talking shit after I still have been silent for fucking months. But but I I think they took my silence. <laughs> so so for what I gather right now is Adam is pissed off because this triple T guy will have people come on his lives streams and and during this whole time that he has been quiet not trying to do anything i have been dogging him and you know uh, i mean i guess what adam is expecting out of this triple t guy is to say is to confront these people and say look he hasn't said anything what why are you why are you dogging adam right now I think that's what I think that's what Adam's asking for now. As as a weakness, it was just me being like, man, I'm done with this shit. Fuck this shit. This is fuck. This is the gayest shit ever. And now it's on because I just said something. Now I got to sit here and argue with a fucking overgrown fucking toddler on the fucking internet for the next fucking six months. Ryan Upchurch ruined my motherfucking career, bro. Do it. Do it. I worked my whole fucking life. I go right back to fucking work. I'm a fucking, I'm a dad. I'm a fucking husband. Motherfucker, do it. Ain't not, nobody scared of Ryan motherfucking up church, period. I'm not saying you are. Yeah. That's not what this other motherfuckers up there were saying. Oh, he'll, Ryan up church will crush him in a battle. But once again. I'm a rapper. That's what, that's the great thing about this country. It's called freedom of speech. People have the right to say what they want, and think what they want, and have their I own damn opinion. That's not what I'm talking about. You, okay, but, so, saying, but you're you, sitting you, here trying to say that that we're promoting the negativity against you. What I'm saying what you is, just said. what I'm saying is, when you say, "Oh, this in the battle, this would happen in the battle, this would happen," nobody's worried about a fucking battle. That's the least of my fucking worries. Do you think that literally we're talking about? Life. We're talking about Ryan Upchurch. Who the fuck is Ryan Upchurch? Who the fuck is Adam Calhoun? <laughs> I'm no different than you and the man sitting next to you, Tyler. We're, we're talking about real life. A year from now, nobody's going to give a fuck about any, any of this shit that's being said right now. That statement is a fact. A year from now, people ain't going to give a shit about what was said. Unless it's brought up in some type of rap beef. This is all going to be forgotten a year from now, maybe two years. You're right. Okay. So I, when you, when motherfuckers like, Ooh, he's scared. Of, Ooh, oh, does it sound, do I, I, I motherfucker? I am not scared of shit. I didn't have to yeah. walk out in that street in fucking Tennessee and fight some dude wearing fucking a bulletproof vest and baby oil all over him. Smelled like a fucking Afghan fucking motherfucking tumbleweed dingleberry. I didn't have to fucking do that. But I fucking went out there in the motherfucking middle of the street like a fucking knucklehead and fucking you you see me running away from shit? I don't do that. I didn't so, say that you did. I I thank you. But I'm saying, do you think I'm gonna run away from Ryan up church? No, I was being quiet because number one, I feel honestly, I feel some type of way for my friend and seeing how he is now. He's he's different, he ain't the same. And I know people in the comments can see that shit. That's the fucking truth. I never turned my fucking back on that man ever. I was never a middleman. If he if fucking he needed anything, of course I'm gonna fucking be there. When uh, FJ Outlaw got out of his fucking deal, Ryan called me. I want to get FJ Outlaw out of his deal. Call so can you make it happen? Yeah, I'll call. I'll call Ken right now. Get fucking Bobby on the phone. Hey, Bob, he'll get off of your fucking neck if you fucking release FJ from his fucking shit. We got him out of there. Done deal. So we're gonna stop it right there. This will be part one of this because I'm not going to sit here for uh, an hour and a half, three hours break, trying to talk about this. So we're going to break this. We'll, this will be part one. Maybe we'll do a part two and then finish it out with part three. So, so far, ga gathering what I've gathered so far in this 30 minutes in, uh, Adam is, of course, it's just over and over saying he's not scared of Ryan Upchurch. Why would anybody be scared of it? He's not scared of anybody. He's confronted this guy, Triple T, with uh, the accusations that he uh, made against him with regards to his uh, 
arrest, like he that he that he did something to some police woman and so forth and so on. And then they they talk about wanting to fight like hell at at Triple T's house and just bullshit. But it sounds to me now that now that they've made it through this uh, cockfighting episode, uh, that they're fixing to get into more of what's going on with with church and adam it seems to me like more things are fixing to come out and we'll see that in part two so you know it's 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 a little interesting uh it's a shame that, that these people are on the internet talking about fighting in their backyards and shit. but at the same time this is, it is what it is so i appreciate you watching till next time see ya